Every family has a story, a history that, for better or worse, is always a part of you. Look, I know you got a lot of faith in Brady. I just want the chance to show you that I can do the job. Nice ride, Mr. Leary. Yep. Did I get Brady? Yeah. Good. Sir? <laughs> That's yours. Why do you always do this? You love one and hate the other. Why can't you just be happy for your brother? He is not my brother. Something's got to change around here. Did I tell you about this dream I've been having? You're in trouble. Save us. Save us. And you're begging for me to save you. Free. Help us. So things ain't ever gonna change unless we change them. Don't come back now, Brady. You hear me? What are you gonna do? What's your plan? Don't have one. Come a long way to work in a mail room. I have to start somewhere. Oh. I just made a uh, fantastic first impression. In some cultures, knocking a person to the floor like that would be seen as a sign of great respect. Pretty sure you just made that up. So tell me something else I should know about you. I love horses. Really? Oh no, you're one of those people who've never actually seen a horse in real life. Not exactly. Aren't you? Please come out and let me see. If my brothers would love to see me in this. <laughs> I didn't know you had any brothers. There's a whole other part of you that I have no idea about, huh? I'd love to fix that. I did do a thing, I swear. I told you not to come. What, what, what were you hoping for? Get your back off. Oh, I wanted to see you. In this place, you don't get but two things. You get hell or you get Jesus. You lost your family. Now you're losing the chance to be the man I know you are.